Now it's your turn. To prove this identity by using this integral definition. All right? Hello, welcome back again to Bad Mathematica channel. On this video, we're going, we are going to discuss the challenge given by black pen, red pen, which is we would like to expand x by x plus y squared by using calculus. So let's get started. So first of all, we define a function of two variables, which is x plus y squared. Now we take the derivative of f with respect to x. So the partial derivative of f with respect to x is going to twice of x plus y, right? Therefore, f itself will be, so this is equal to 2x plus 2y, right? So f will be the antiderivative of this guy, which is x squared and then plus the antiderivative of this with respect to x, which is 2xy, and then plus a function in y variable. So let's call it h of y. So that is our f. Now, if we're using the original definition of f, we have f of y is also twice of x plus y which is 2x plus 2y, right? But if we use this definition of f, then f of y, partial derivative of f with respect to y is equal to, so the derivative of that is zero, and the derivative of this is twice of x, and the derivative of h is h prime of y. Now we compare the two, Therefore, we need to conclude that h prime of y have to be equal to twice of y. So h prime of y is 2y. Therefore, h of y is equal to y squared plus a constant. And plugging this back there, we have f of x y is equal to x squared plus 2xy plus y squared plus constant. But remember that f is equal to x plus y squared. In particular, f of 0, 0 is equal to 0. Meanwhile, here we have f of 0, 0 is equal to c. Therefore, c is equal to 0, and hence x plus y squared, which is equal to f x of y, is equal to that, where the c is equal to 0. So we have x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. And we are done. Okay, so before I leave, I give you another challenge. Now expand x plus y to the power of n by using calculus. Have fun! See you again in the next video. Bye!